Welcome to Everyday Experiments, Full Bloom. Let's celebrate spring. Stop motion is a technique where you take a series of photos to create a cool animation. Let's make a stop motion animation with these carnations I picked up at the market. We take a sequence of photos, shifting our subjects a bit each time to make it look like they are moving. We can make the flowers grow, split, we can even turn them into fruits and veggies before turning them back into flowers. Next, we'll experiment with the slow-mo feature, which slows down your film and gives moving objects a dreamlike quality. We like to try moving things in a few different ways and see what we end up with. For this experiment, we used a highlighter to color our water. When the flowers soaked it up, we found it gave them a fluorescent glow under UV light. We just played around with these flowers, hanging and swinging them in a few different ways, just to see what we get back. To give a sense of depth, we put pressed flowers onto different layers of glass panes and moved the camera slowly over them. Water takes on many interesting shapes as it moves but you can't really see it in real time. With slow-mo, you can capture every last detail. To create your own time-lapse, set up a shot with flowers, water, and a lamp. We shot these plants for just about eight hours overnight. How much the flowers blossom might really surprise you. And that's the fun with experiments.